I spent over 10 hours working on a new enchanting area for our base, placing thousands and digging thousands of blocks. And here's how it turned out. Welcome to Minecraft Hardcore Survival. You guys know how it works. If I die, the series ends. Welcome to our enchanting room. Now, I haven't really completely finished yet. I'm not going to lie, but I think it's pretty close to being done. All I have to do really is kind of put some more lights up in the on the roof and kind of change up the, the stone. So make it more like a bit stone bricks, you know, have it like a little texture mixed in with the leaves. So like stone bricks and then a little bit of cobble here and there. And yeah, oh my God, there's a skeleton nearby. And I'm going to make the floor grass as well and kind of make it like kind of like a little overgrown kind of little underground area underneath our nether portal, which is pretty sick. Honestly, when I oh, when I was building this, by the way, this block right here, I remember if I break this block, all of our sheep above us fell straight through, which is not good. Like I lost a lot of sheep, but at the same time, I got a lot of meat. I have this is half like nearly half a stack of, of meat, but I have so much more in our chest. So we're set for life on meat. Now, if we come over here, I actually have a kind of some more plans. So this is going to be our trophy room. Now, I think it's going to be pretty sick if we go through this because this trophy room, I reckon we can have like an ender dragon area. Like that. we put the egg on like a little pedestal. We can have like the dragon head. We can have like the wither skeleton heads. We can have like a zombie heads, etc. And we can have like a little trophy room in there, which would be crazy. And back here, I was going to do a storage area because honestly, we're low-key running out of area in our house, but not really. But like, I think, I think it'd be better if we have like a little storage area back here with like heaps of chests and maybe an automated storage compartment thing. And in here, I actually don't know what to do here yet. So if you guys have any ideas, let me know down below. What I was kind of thinking was... It's kind of underground, right? And recently I've I've been I've been kind of like, I don't know, I've just I've just been feeling the kind of like the underground kind of base thing. I decided to come down here and honestly the first the first idea was just to have this little bridge over here and when you go through the bridge, the enchanting table would be like right here and it'd be like a tiny room. But I was like that's boring. So, I decided to make it literally, I don't know, I think it's 32 blocks by 32 blocks but in a circle. But with that being said, let's go back up and let me show you what kind of my plan was now this is that little corridor to get to the little enchanting area down there no well, not little but our enchanting area down there all right and we've got these two armor stands right next to each other because i want to kind of put every like armor set that i've used before so let's go do that right now so we'll just dress up one of them with our iron for now we can probably get better armor later but we'll have this guy with that that's pretty sick okay and let's go over here and let's you know let's go to sleep oh i haven't said hi to nigel yet hey nigel how you going Hey, go on. Jane, what's up? We need to get a name tag for you. Now, another thing that I did off screen, I kind of made a TikTok about it, but this cherry blossom tree. Now, we have our first cherry blossom, which is honestly, I'm, uh, I really like our cherry blossom tree. We're going to have a, a little bit more than just this one. Obviously, we're going to have like one over there and maybe I think I think there's two over there and then one over here. But I'm really liking how this came together. Like I made a TikTok about it. And if you want to follow me on TikTok, it's down below in the description. And now we're going to come. Over. Oh, hey, Steve. Hey, what's going on? All right, but I haven't been down here in ages. And I think we should probably come down here. Like how I made the water elevator down to our enchanting area. I kind of want to do that here as well. So we can go all the way down to the bottom just without, you know, having to deal with any mobs or anything because, you know, it is hardcore. Obviously, I don't want to die. We're going to have to kind of move all of these bad boys out of here. And I don't know how I'm going to do it. I think I might just make a little pen over here for now and kind of just use the wheat to drag them over here. And then we can start getting on the way with this. But we're going to have to collect some materials first. All right, we have a couple fences. We're just going to use these and we're just going to, you know what? We're going to grab our wheat first just because we need to drag them out of there. And okay, let's go back. Honestly, I just realized I still had the shaders on, but you know what? We'll keep it on for now. So we're going to come over here and we're going to kind of just, just make it kind of like this. Hopefully we can, oh, we, we're going to need a lot more than that. Eh? Yeah, we're going to need a lot more. Okay. And I think this should be enough. We've got 18 birch and we've got oak fences as well. So we should be all right. We're going to just kind of bring it out one more. We're going to bring this over as well. Is that the right level? Yep. Okay. And you know what? We're going to make it two gates as well because there's going to be a lot of sheep in here and cows. I was thinking we should maybe like separate it, but you know what? We can make a little area over here. Another little area for the sheep. Oh, we're not going to have enough. Damn. Oh, you know what? We will. We will. We will. We will. Okay. That's all right. There we go. Look at that. Perfect. All right. So let's mine these two blocks right here. Oh, you know what? We'll mine these three. And we're going to have to build a little way so they can come up. There we go. They're coming. Here they are. Let's go. Let's go, cows. There you go. One by one. One by one. Come on. There we go. And I'm just going to close these on real quick. Sorry. Now I'm going to come and just kind of like drag them all out. Come on. Okay. We're going to have to, we're going to have to make it a lot bigger. All right. God damn. Hey, why are you guys? Hey, get back in there. Get back, get back in there. 
Uh, come on. All of you, there we go. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's a whole horde. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Wait, why can't I? Oh, hello there. Where's the where's the door? There it is. Okay, come on. Come in, come in, come in, come in. Oh wait. There we go. Come in, come in, come in, come in, come in, come in, come in. There they go. Oh my god. There you go. Have some, have some, have some nice wheat. There you go, guys. There you go. Oh my days. Okay. There's heaps heaps coming out, so we're gonna need to drag them over. Come on. Come on. No. Back inside. Back inside, back inside, inside, inside. Come here, over this way, this way, this way. There we go. <laughs> oh, okay. How many's left? You know what? We'll kill you guys. It's all right. We got, we got enough cows. Come on. What are you trying to run away for? Why are you running? Hello. Bang. Oh. Bang. Oh. Bang. Oh. Okay. So we've done the cows. Now it's time to do the sheep. And come on. Oh, here they come. Oh my God. Here they come. Here they come. There you go. One by one. It's going to be one by one. One by one. Oh, come on. Come in. All right. We're going to, you know what? We're going to whip out fence because then we're going to have to place it very fast. Come here. 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 Oh my God. All right. How many, how many is, how many is in there? There's not that much. Okay. All right. That's all right. I'm going to just come on. Okay. The, hey, where are you guys going? Oh my God. There we go. In this corner. In this corner. In this corner. And I'm going to have to just. Oh, oh, close. Okay, I think that should be enough in there. We're just gonna kill the rest because that's all right. We have uh, enough in there just to be able to breed for now, and we also have enough meat, so it's all right. And you know what? We'll just leave the rest out here. You know, they can they can chill. Let's put some lanterns out here because we do not want anything move. Thank you. There we go. Oh, look at that. Look at that. You guys are glowing. One here. Put one back here, and put one there. There we go. So we have a little tiny farm now, but we've got to actually start collecting materials for this barn right here. So I'm going to go to bed. All right, it's a new day. It's a new morning. Now, I think it's time to actually start collecting materials. So that being said, let me just empty out my inventory and meat area. Oh, look, look how much meat we have. We have so much meat. Unbelievable. We're going to put some meat in here. We're going to cook that. I've been actually meaning to make a smoker for cooking and we need to make also a blast furnace. So let's make that real quick. Let's grab some cobble. Uh, I don't actually remember how to do it. So let's search it up. All right. So we're going to need some uh, some logs and we're going to need a furnace. That's easy. Okay. We've got a furnace and we're going to grab some logs. We've got some spruce. You know what? We'll grab these and then we're going to make ourselves so it's just one smoker for now. Here we go. There we go. We've got a smoker. All right. So we're going to, you know what? We're going to chuck this one. Hmm. Where should we chuck it? Let's put it. Hmm. I don't know. Should we put it? Hmm. We put it here. You know what? Okay. That's, that's where it's going. That's where we're leaving it there for now. And that's where it's going to stay. Let's grab all of our meat. That cooked very fast. God damn. Now I'm thinking for our little farmhouse thing that we, I want to build. I'm, I'm thinking of using some oak. We're going to use some stripped oak because we're going to stick, stick with a theme, I guess. Like, you know, we've been using stripped oak with, throughout all of our builds. So I'm going to use some stripped oak again now. But we, what we've got to collect, we've got to get some more stone bricks. So we've got to collect some stone or you know what? We have cobble so we can just start smelting that. So I've just realized that I have stone bricks. But the fact that I have a lot of stone bricks is actually kind of going to be for the enchanting room downstairs because I'm going to work on that off screen because it does take ages and it's it's just, it's going to be pretty boring for you guys to see. It's just going to be me replacing some stone blocks with some stone brick. And that's basically it. But with that being said, I think we could probably snag like maybe a stack from here. And I think that should help a little bit. But we're going to cook our cobblestone in here. And we, that should help us get enough stone brick for our actual farmhouse. So we're going to put that in there. And we're going to put 32 in there and 32 in there. Now, a blast furnace. Can we actually make that or... My trip. I don't know what it's called. Is this called smelter or hmm? I actually fully forgot what it's called. Anyways, we need to collect some bricks. So we're gonna need a lot of clay. So I need to grab my shovel. I don't know where I put my shovel though. And off screen, I had to actually collect a lot of diamonds. I had to remake all of our tools. So off screen, I did recreate another book area and I used this enchanting room to get ourselves efficiency five shovel. And I got a book for unbreaking one, which I just chucked on my pickaxe because this was nearly dead. But with that being said, we are gonna grab my shovel right here that I've got in my hand and we're gonna just go and try collect some clay. So I think we should probably go out this way. I think there's a lot of clay over this way. So let's go. Now there should be clay somewhere in here, I think. Is that clay? I think that's clay. Yeah, there is clay. All right, we'll grab this clay real quick. Hopefully not drown at the same time, but you know, it is what it is. Oh my God, I do not want to swim. I just want to get some clay. Thank you. All right. So we're going to need a couple, um, maybe maybe like two stacks of, of bricks. So we're going to have to collect a lot of clay. Let's see if there's any in here. No. Okay. But there should be on the, there should be some clay on the riverbank. So let's do that real quick. Oh, no, we are no. hungry. Okay. So we nearly have three stacks of clay. I don't know if I need more. I won't lie. Let's see how much clay that actually makes us. So we have 14. We have 30. We're probably going to need, okay, we'll need a bit more. Oh, damn. 
the massive ravine down here. Oh, damn, that's a massive cave down there. Okay, we might have to come back to this later in another episode. If you guys want to see me come, go to that cave, let me know. Oh, there's a beehive. All right, bet, 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 bet. So, maybe... Oh, my God, this place is crazy. I've actually never been on this side. Whoa. God damn. All right, well, anyways, we're just looking for clay now. So, oh, that scared me. Okay, let's see if we can find any clay. I really can't find any right... Oh, there it is. There it is. There's the clay that we're looking for. And I think that should be enough. So, let's see how many we have now. We have probably a stack and a bit. Yep, we have a stack and a bit of clay. Okay, we'll take that. We'll take that. Because now, we don't really need, like, a lot of stacks of clay. Well, bricks, sorry. We kind of just need a little bit just for, like, a kind of like a chimney area, which I'm going to do, which will, I reckon will look pretty sick because, you know, a farmhouse got to have a little chimney here and there. But anyway, let's go back to our house and start smelting these bad boys. Oh, look how nice that cherry blossom tree looks. That's so sick. With the cherry blossom trees, I actually want to do another one here. Obviously, I have it right here. But I want, it, I want it to kind of overhang in there. So it'll be kind of like an archway. And then we can actually kind of like spread our village or our little base across as well. So we can actually have a bigger village. But for now, uh, I obviously we'll probably make the cherry blossom tree soon. I'll probably build it soon. But I don't think we'll expand our base just yet. But eventually I think we will. And that will look pretty sick, I think. Okay, now I'm back home. Let's actually... Oh, we have some stone. Oh, all of our stones. Yes, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so let's cook some of our clay. We might actually have to... You know what? We're going to use our stone cutter just to get them stone bricks. Here we go. We'll grab some of that. And we're going to have to actually get some stone stairs. And we're going to get some stone slabs because they're very useful. And we might actually have to grab a couple brick, stone brick walls. So we'll grab like 10 of those. And then the rest, we'll just get some stone bricks. And we'll just keep some stone just in case, you know, if we ever need... If I ever need to actually make some extra extra stuff so with that being said we have oh terracotta <gasps> wait 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 no 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 oh my god no oh my god okay so i've made the mistake of actually making the clay balls into actual clay blocks which i didn't even realize that i did that so let's actually break all these bad boys and we're gonna we're gonna actually have to re-smelt and maybe collect some more clay because i accidentally made 16 terracotta just by being a little bit a little bit on the silly side so let's get these real quick they, oh look at the, the efficiency five helps so much especially when i was mining out the enchanting room it helped drastically because i was i was able to mine through that whole thing so much faster okay let's go okay and there we go that should give us some bricks now on top of that i actually want to collect some more oak because we do not actually have that much wood left though so before we do that i'm gonna go to bed and there we go okay so it's daytime now i don't know which way to go we might actually you know what i have 26 levels i'm gonna go downstairs real quick and i'm gonna enchant my axe because i had to make a new axe because obviously my axe broke i think it might it might have been in the last episode but i don't know but let's go okay so oh we need some lapis i don't know if i have lapis is there lapis in here there is let's go okay so grab some lapis Ooh, chuck our axe in there and efficiency two. Oh, we don't have 28 levels you know what efficiency two it is we'll take that i'll take that i'll take that so let's go grab our oak all right i think we're gonna go over this way because i think there's like a massive oak forest all right now we're gonna grab some oak the spider hey die you yes unlucky i hate the noise of spiders why like you don't have to make that noise it doesn't feel nice in my eyeballs i mean in my ears in my ears <laughs> we're just gonna and we're gonna keep collecting our oak oh my goodness I've also been thinking, because we have only iron leggings, I might actually make some diamond leggings because that would actually be very useful. You know, we kind of have a half an armor bar gone and it's kind of annoying me. So I think we should just do it. For now, let's just keep getting our oak and then we'll get back to that later. And if you guys are enjoying the video so far, leave a like down below. Maybe we can get to like 20 likes. Don't forget to plant your saplings, guys. Gotta plant the saplings again. Gotta plant the saplings. Okay, now that we have a stack and a bit of oak we're gonna get one more stack and that should be good for now and my kind of idea is to have like a kind of contrast feel so i'm gonna kind of use the stripped oak as a way to be able to like contrast it with the normal just oak and i think it'll turn out pretty sick and we're gonna make it back to our house which is literally right here <laughs> we didn't actually go that far i thought we did now we can actually make our bricks so that's good there we go we're gonna actually grab all the rest in here and obviously i kind of forgot to talk about this before is there a zombie nearby? What the hell? Oh my god, there's a zombie upstairs. What the hell? What the hell? Okay, you know what? We're gonna place a torch up there. There we go. And what the... F that scared the hell out of me. Another thing I want to talk about before we start our farm build is our piston door. So, I know you guys saw at the start of the video, but 
here it is in actual person. So it kind of closes off. It's a three by three door. And then you go and we go through. And there it is. But the actual way that I've been doing this is actually there's some redstone down here. If we just kind of go this way, there we go. Now I have all this redstone down here that leads all the way. So there's some glowstone down here because of our corridor. But if we go through this way, then all of our contraption is here. We've got the observers, which took me ages to figure out because I'm not the best at redstone. Oh my God, I lost the way we came in. Where did we come in from? Oh my goodness. Oh, there we go. But I'm not that good at redstone, but I, you know, I do enjoy it sometimes and it makes our base look a lot cooler. So why not actually do it? You know what I'm saying? But yeah, so with that being said, it's open and then we press it and it closes and then we press it again and it opens. So yeah, I just, it took me a while, but I really do like it. And it kind of brings our little kind of hidden enchantment area together. I think we're going to grab our chest and we're going to get all of our stuff ready and we're going to start our build. Okay, so I have two chests. I'm going to grab all the bricks in here for now because there's not that much left to smelt, but we'll grab them now and we're going to go over to our farm and place our chests so we can actually have our collection of materials. There we go. So now we're going to put all our bricks in here. Actually, you know what? We're going to turn these bricks into actual bricks. There we go. And that should be sweet. We have we nearly have a stack, which is good. We're going to put our stone bricks in here and stone and stone walls. We're going to put our oak in there. Look at that zombie pig man. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? These guys annoy the hell out of me, but you know, I can't hit them or else something not good is going to happen. But anyway, we're going to put our... <laughs> What's going on, bro? Do you want to fight or something? Come on now. And I did talk about it before, but let's make our leggings right now because why the heck not? So let's do that. There we go. And now we have diamond leggings. Let's get rid of these bad boys. And you know what? Let's go and put these leggings inside our enchantment area. So here we go. There we go. Now, I think I've collected most of the materials that we're going to need. We've got, our, we've got our wool that we're going to use. And we've got our bricks. And we've got our stone bricks and our oak, which we're going to basically use. And that's going to be basically it. We might use some cobble here and there, but that should be all right. And we're also going to need some lanterns, but... With that being said, I think I'm going to get to the farm build now. It's going to be one heck of a show. So get your, grab your popcorn and we're going to get straight to it. All right, so this is our little farmhouse. I really, I really like this farmhouse. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool. I mean, I the original plan was for me to make a barn. I, I was gonna make a barn to put all the animals in, but I decided that like we could have like a farmhouse where we have like obviously some smoke. I've put some smokers in here just for easier cooking access, I guess. You know, it's, it's right next to the farm, so I guess you know it's a good area so we can also keep storage at the bottom. So if we go up here and then we come down, oh. And down here, we can actually, we have a campfire, you know, make it, we can put some bookshelves, make it look nice. But down here, we can have like our storage and we can also have storage up here as well, obviously. Probably up here as well, because this is, you know, a lot easier to access. And over here, we're going to keep all these like animals over here, because I think it'd be a lot easier as well. And it's probably better if they're outside as well. And I'm going to leave the video there, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys have enjoyed leave a like down below this took me a long time to build so i would greatly appreciate it if you want to check out all the last episodes i'll leave a playlist link in the description and with that being said i'll see you guys on the next minecraft sunday peace <laughs>